Hey guys, I am here today with uh, Steph Sit Down. If you're new here, Steph Sit Down is basically a stream of consciousness kind of video where I talk about whatever the hell I want. Kind of, it's, it's kind of therapeutic. You get to see a little bit into my life, and I don't get to know me better. And it's just therapeutic for me to get things out there. If I have them all trucked in here. And uh, that's basically how these go. Kind of like back in the day, kids called them vlogs. But, uh, yeah. I feel bad I haven't been putting out r any really good content lately. I've just been not feeling like doing videos. I've just been going through some stuff emotionally. And it sucks. It honestly sucks. That's the only way I could describe it. And it just... A situation happened, and I... It brought up a lot of questions about, like, you reflect on other areas of your life, and uh, I'm okay. But it just... It kind of hit me hard, made me sad, made me emotional. Uh, not like, I'm okay, like I was okay with this situation. Uh, I was, it just made me pissed off. I really pissed off. And it did kind of upset me some, because it got me to think about other things. So, uh, I'm sorry I'm a little vague with that. I'm not ready to be comfortable talking about it yet, because... I still hold a lot of anger, so I don't want to say anything I would regret. But anyway, if you just could also keep or uh, be patient with me because it's May and May is never a good month for me, emotional-wise, mentally. It. It just sucks and drains the life out of me. And I'm being completely upfront and honest with you. It does. I've suffered a lot of losses in me. Uh, on the 10th, it will be... 17 years? Or 18 years since my father died? And that's still a big hit to me. And... A year ago, this month, uh, I lost my first cat, Cosmo. He lived 10 years, and he was my best friend. He he knew, like, I could really use him right now, because he always knew what to do, like, when I was sad, and he'd spend time with me and stuff. I do have my new cat. Uh, She's not acting like herself lately. She's usually a lot spunkier, but, uh, she's not him. So, it's weird. Uh, also, my Nana is not doing very well. Uh, she's ready to go, though. When the time comes. Uh, she lived a big life. And she's not my real grandmother. I lost my regular grandparents years ago, but I grew up with this family, and I always called her Nana, and I love her <laughs> to bits. She, she makes you feel loved, and you always have a fun time and funny stories. You're always laughing when you're around her, and if you pray or send healing thoughts, Send them her way. Because she needs it. Uh, let's talk about some other things that are better. Um, RuPaul's Drag Race, I just watched. Uh, and it's down to the final three. I won't spoil it for you. But I was kind of sad because I was rooting for the underdog. And they got sent home. But the three, the queens that are going, they're like top notch, I think. Like, it's really hard because... If you were to ask me at the beginning of the season that I 
uh, who I thought would win, definitely, it was not this list. Uh, but I, uh, they all have great qualities in them, and any one of them can take it, I think. Like, I don't have a one that I'm rooting for the most. Da, 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 da. I watched The Voice tonight too. Uh, Alison Porter sang one of my favorite songs. She sang Let Him Fly by Patty Griffin. Patty Griffin, if you never listen to Patty Griffin, go look her up on Spotify now. Because if you like folk music and just music that hits your heart and your soul, like, listen to it because I don't know it's good music like it, it it makes me cry that's the kind of music it is like it's it has heart it has soul and it's just her voice is beautiful uh, reviews I'm expecting some house washer wax in the next few, either maybe two weeks or sooner. I don't know. So I'll have that to review. It's getting harder. Like, I, I would love to do reviews on products in the indie world, like bath items and wax. Not bathtub items, like just bath items and wax. But I don't have the budget for it right now. I just can't. And I really just want to be able to do it. it. It's hard. I, I went last year for a long time buying stuff. And I did great reviews. People loved them. And I was happy with it. It made, that kind of stuff makes me happy that I can do that and provide people with honest information on items I have tried and if they would work for someone. And I really want to do that again, but I don't have the money. So, if you want a company or you know someone that has a company and you want, they want people to review, get in touch with me, YouTube message me, or email me, I would love to do that. Thanks. Bye. That'll be it for this sit down.